A journey comes to an end tonight. Gannon University's women's basketball team was defeated tonight by Cal State San Marcos in the Division II Women's Basketball Championship quarterfinals. The game was held in St. Joseph, Missouri, and many longtime Gannon fans couldn't make the trip to support the team. But as Matt Mathias explains, it did not stop fans from showing their spirit or supporting the team tonight. Matt. Well, that's right, Jen. Gen University hosting the first of two watch parties to support both the women and men's teams as they compete in the Division II Elite Eight. Golden Knight diehards can't get enough of the success both men's and women's basketball teams have been having this year. The student athletes have been ranked as some of the best Division II teams in the country all season and are competing for a national championship. It's a special time for both our men and women to be in the Elite Eight and we're so proud of them and what they've achieved to get to that point and so now it's just an um, opportunity to cheer them on and be with them as they take on the competition. The students have been cheering on the team all season, but alumni and Gannon basketball season ticket holders continue to show out in a big way Monday night at a Gannon organized watch party. Even with both teams transitioning away from their home courts while the Hammer Mill Center gets a facelift, they stayed passionate about their teams. Well, I graduated from Gannon in the early 60s, got season tickets shortly after that. My dad attended almost all the games with me. Geltra says he bleeds maroon and gold along with many others cheering the teams on from home. And win or lose, it's been a year to remember for Gannon University basketball. Hard to believe, really, but uh, great, for this, great for the city and great for the college. Uh, tremendous experience to see how they keep coming together and work hard and harder and harder and harder. Uh, it's just uh, unbelievable. And although the girls lost tonight in Missouri, fans will continue to do their part and cheer on the boys tomorrow. And Mike Fenner will have much more on the game tonight in sports. Jen. All right, Matt, thank you.